If you can't tell by the title already, it's currently my dad's birthday. So me and my sisters have decided that we're gonna put a little dinner together for him to surprise him for his birthday tonight. So me and one of my younger sisters, we're about to head over to Walmart. We're gonna go get a couple of groceries to cook for him. And I will see y'all when I get there. We made it to Walmart, so we finna go up in there. I still gotta actually look up the ingredients for what it is I'm about to cook. So I'm finna get on my phone real quick, try to figure that out, and then I'll show y'all the groceries that we pick up. Say hey to no oh you want no on the camera? Yeah, really on the camera. Say hey no Wolies. <laughs> this is my nephew No Wolies. <laughs> <laughs> I know for a fact that I need some sharp cheddar, so I'm gonna grab some sharp cheddar. Um, Kobe Jack, if anybody see the Kobe Jack, please tell me now. Okay, some Kobe Jack cheese, we're gonna grab some Kobe Jack cheese. Now I need to find some half and half, some cheese sauce and some noodles, and I think that's all I'm gonna need for this recipe. So tell me if you see half and half there. I don't know. I'm gonna just get this some. Let's get this half and half. Cheese sauce gonna be with macaroni. All right, some L. Do I need two pounds though? I think I only need one. Cause your crock pot on the smaller side, yeah, ain't it? Do you see? I see side. three. I see two. Uh, is there a one pound option? How many pounds is these? These one pound, but I don't like. It's kind of elbowish. Oh yeah, that's elbow noodles. It's got them ridges in it. So this kind, okay, because we need one pound. We'll get this noodles. <laughs> oh, cheese sauces. They had like a, a can. Because I think that's like nacho cheese. Yeah, that's nacho cheese. And you know, you use that for the um, cheese. I think it was like Campbell's like canned, um, what are the canned goods? Got a cheese soup. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I think I need two cans of this. Uh, cheddar cheese soup. Okay, two cans of that. My sister had to grab her some stuff too. She's making some, are they vegan or not? Yeah, these are regular ones. I have a vegan one. Oh, is you making that for everybody? Yeah, for everybody. Oh, she making everybody meatball subs. Grab a small thing of milk for just in case I didn't get enough. Be honest, I like these off bread crescent rolls specifically because they big and buttery, and I promise you they taste better than the regulars. I'm putting y'all on right now. Hey, we got everything that we needed out of Walmart, so now we're finna run over to the liquor store because we gotta get him some gifts. She know he likes beers, I know he likes cigars, so we're gonna go the easy, cheap route and we're gonna get him <laughs> some, some beers and some cigars. We're gonna go get some cute to wrap it in at Dollar Tree, so I guess I'll meet y'all at the liquor store. We done left the liquor store. We got him a little bottle of lick. She got him some beers. We done got some cigars. So now we finna head over to Dollar Tree to go get cute little bags to put all this in. Some tea lights? I just thought about it, yeah. Now we in Dollar Tree. All we need is these three things. I hope we can remember these three things. We need some tinfoil pans. We need some bowls. And what else you said we need? Oh, um, tea, light tea light candles. lights. But it was something else you needed. The pans? The pa oh, and the candy for Nolan. Candy oh, for candy Nolan. For Nolan. Some candles, some 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 bowls, yeah. which we are at the bowls now, and some to cook the food in. So let's figure out a bowl and then get up out of here. We're gonna get this big red bowl for Derricka to put on her beers. I like that. And then we need a tiny red bow to oh, put on his little cigar. Oh, oh that's it. cute. <laughs> Do you see a tiny one? A small one. Yeah. Oh. These, these kind of small that's kind of big they look a little too Christmassy oh yay perfect okay tiny little red bows found the little candles we got some tea candles a bag of chips cuz yeah I need a snack Grab this biscuit simply because it's the last one and I know Bea eat it. It looks interesting, so I'm gonna pick up this because I accidentally bought vanilla protein shakes and I hate them, so I'm gonna try with this salted caramel syrup. Finally made it back home, but if y'all can't tell, it is currently pouring down raining and I have to carry all of this stuff in the house. So I'm gonna take all this stuff in the house. When I get it out, I'm gonna show y'all real quick the recipe that I'm gonna use for this little macaroni and cheese. 
At this point, it's gonna take me three hours to cook everything, and I only have two hours to be to their house. So I'm turning this crock pot on high, and I'm just gonna toss everything in there. I'm not even measuring. I'm gonna just let my heart go for it. Whole thing of half and half. They said two or three cups. I'm gonna just assume this is close enough. Then they said two cans of um of cheddar cheese soup. So I'm gonna throw the two cans of cheddar cheese soup up in now. Let me get a spoon. trash bag. Let me get a bag. <laughs> trash bag. Put my milk in now so I can stay organized. Okay, get my cheese soup. Oh, that looks disgusting. This, that's disgustingly good. Put that up in now. If this macaroni don't turn out good, I swear to y'all, my family will judge me for the rest of my days. Okay. For the second can. Get that open without breaking a nail. Hold on now. This water. Man, you want to open up this for me? Come on, I'm in a rush. I'm fat. I'm fat. Dump a bag of sharp cheddar me. cheese up in now. You talking all over the camera. I'm sorry. Come on, baby. Any day now. Hand me some seasons at the, the cabinet. Just hand me all of them. Or as you in the game. Other can of soup. And now we're just gonna use all the seasons. What a salt, the pepper. Move, move, move. <laughs> Thank you. All right, now we're just gonna season it up. We're gonna do some pepper. Can you ugly? Some pepper. Plenty of sea salt. <sighs> Mm, a little bit more salt, just to be on the safe side. Then we're gonna do some Creole seasoning, cause yes. We're gonna do some garlic powder. Plenty of garlic powder, cause I'm obsessed with garlic powder, garlic mac. I don't need Italian seasoning, no basil, onion powder, yes. And I'm going to say paprika for the end. Last thing we got to add, the noodles. Open them up. I hope this crock pot big enough for all this. trash now mix get this all up in now the crock pot already burning hot thank you jesus that's actually mixing really well i'm already seeing creamy noodle soupiness coming through okay this might not be a bad little recipe i'm not mad at this right now at all i'm kind of liking how this turning out so I guess it's just gotta cook the noodles. Everything else pretty much is just milk and cheese. I ain't add no raw eggs or nothing. So I guess it's just gonna heat it up to enough where the noodles get all cooked. Now they say cover it for three hours and don't touch it. So to give it that baked look, I'ma top it with more cheese. Save a little bit for just in case I need to stir and retop at the end. And then I'm going to just 
Top this with some paprika for color so it looks like it was baked. All right, and that's it. They say just cover it for three hours, so I'm gonna leave it alone, let it do what it do, let it sit for three hours. Hopefully it's good. I'm not gonna check back in with y'all for my dad's actual birthday. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make a TikTok showing his little birthday treat that we put together tonight. So if you're not already doing that, follow me on TikTok and I will see y'all on the next vlog. <laughs> Tell me that something that is all me.